Okay. It's recording. I guess I can take that off of infrared. Turn it back on. Open this. Oh. I turned my recorder back on too. Alrighty. Well, I caught just very little bit <coughs> on I caught just a little bit on the recorder. I don't know if I caught anything on the camera because I did not get a chance to look at that yet. I'm hoping I did, but I guess we'll find out. But it's time to put everything away. And then start setting up for my last thing that I'm going to try tonight. I don't know if I'm going to keep the Ouija board out while I do it or not. Mainly because I don't feel like getting my ass kicked by my fiance. Fucking Ivory, you scared the shit out of me, little bitch. Fuck you. Because if it is pissed off, and I'll let, I don't want it to. Come after me and stay attached to me and all that shit. I don't want that. There is something truly connected to this mirror.
personally with this mirror it was fun whenever we first got it it was interesting it was intriguing but to be truthful to be honest with everybody other than a couple really really scary freaky disturbing things that happen not really much has happened at all um, and it really sucks granted it's only five bucks that amount of but in our reality a little more than that because right after I bought the mirror right after I bought the mirror I bought the camera and the digital recorder so A little bit more than five bucks out of my pocket. That's why I really, really, really was hoping this thing would actually do some shit. Mainly so I can help all the big ghost hunting people out with having a little bit of evidence of my own of paranormal now I have my own stories that I know that happened to me you know I would love to eventually get my own thing going 